As the cleanup from the storm continues, the Red Cross Disaster Relief is training volunteers who want to help those affected. The organization held a special training today. WCBI's Stephanie Poole was there and has more on what the agency is teaching before sending volunteers out to help. Hours after tornado struck Columbus, volunteers began to emerge to help those who had lost everything. As the number of volunteers continue to increase, the Red Cross Disaster Relief wants to make sure they are properly trained. We have people that's coming in that has chainsaws, that has everything, and they'll come to these doors and get their instruction as to where they are needed. During a training support class Saturday, instructor Bob Snyder reviewed requirements for volunteering. The class also covered instructions on distributing emergency supplies, working inside shelters, and assisting with feedings. We can come up here and do three classes and do an overview and see if people are interested in being Red Cross volunteers, then they'll receive that course and get credit for it. Snyder says because of the urgency, he and other instructors are working quicker than usual so these volunteers can get out into the communities. Due to the emergency situation up here, we've condensed them down into uh, maybe half the time that it normally takes so that we can get volunteers trained up and ready to go and get out in the field and do some volunteering. Saturday's class was mandatory for volunteers who want to work with the Red Cross. Reporting in Lowndes County, Stephanie Poole, WCBI News. 16 volunteers showed up for Red Cross training today.